What's up, y'all? I got a banger from Alpha Central. Let's get straight into it. It's me. Um, I'm looking for a rich husband. I wonder oh, yeah. if you could be him. Yeah. That's Are you single? Me. No, that's oh, definitely okay. not Oh, okay. No, your wife's very lucky. Hey. I'm going to go ahead and say, that's a good looking older guy, though. He's a bit of a silver fox, wasn't he? Hey. How are you guys? Yeah, we're good. Clean. I'm trying to find a husband, right? Are any of you guys Keep single? Looking. Oh my god, yes, it's my rich husband! No, 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 bad news, bad news. No, don't say that. You're supposed to be helping me. What the hell? I got she's sabotaged. A runner, she's a Did I just get caught by someone's dad? <laughs> Man, the guy was like, she's bad news, she's bad news. Matter in a guy? I like I'm about to, guys. Um, Men can't change that. Okay, well. I you like can makeup. change how much makeup you wear. I can take off my makeup and still be pretty, so. Preach. Well, that sucks. My Uber's here. Uh, Uber has a message for her. Your Uber's there. Poor girl. The count is too high for a guy for you to consider dating. Over 40. Over five. <laughs> Over five. Wait, wait, yeah. wait. Well, Ma'am. Over five. <laughs> Ma'am, have you seen your outfit? <laughs> oh my. Just a question. He's out. He's the first yeah. one out, right? We're, yeah, yeah exactly. you're done. <laughs> she she shamed us for having more than five, <laughs> and she's dressed like Santa's little helper. I'm just asking. <laughs> you're dressed as Santa. Exactly. We could be a move. I don't think you'll like me based on the things I've done with my body, and I oh. apologize. Proof: Women want the things they can't bring. A body count of five? What you do for? I feel like that's unreal. Most guys, God, five? For a girl, I get, but for a guy, it's so much harder. Tell him. Tell him. What is that? I make films. Oh, you like yeah. to make movies? Like... Yeah, I like to make my own movies. Oh, so yeah. where can I see it? Like in the nearest theater? You can see it. <laughs> where can I see it in the nearest theater? Not a theater, bud. On YouTube? Netflix? <laughs> you can What's see that? it on your nearest phone. Oh, cool. Yeah. So, like, um. Tubi. Yeah, we're like mm -hmm. only fans. Um, I'm at the door. Hell yeah. Um, yeah. She's a runner, oh. she's a track yeah. star. She's a runner, she's a it's track the fact star. that even she was. Bruh, it's unreal. Even, yeah, even she was What's like, you know what? I probably shouldn't say what I do. <laughs> no, what is. Oh, she's a stripper? No, it's a no for me. Chat, let me know. Would you date a girl that's a stripper? Um, it's ooh, an absolute All right, no. well, Nucci, that is all the balloons popped. But we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Ain't no guy trying to wife a stripper. <laughs> one by one, and they all... There ain't no way, cuzzo. Uh-uh. <laughs> A family, what are you doing? Stop it, get some help. She might the level of cringe, honey. What are you doing? Like, nobody's even paying attention to you. What are you doing? Good lord, bruv. Good lord, man. Nice to meet you, Mohammed. Can you rate my art one to ten? No, but why? Excuse me, rate my art one to ten. <laughs> I'm gonna show you secretly, okay? So my viewers can't see. No, thank you. Well, I show you and you tell me. No, thank Look. You. No? Oh. Yeah, no. you do it. Oh. Okay, tell him. But he doesn't want to be in it. You're already in it. No, no, no. Thank you. I'm being a 304 you just tell fails. Me number. It's not difficult. A five. a five, but you didn't even look. Do you no, want to look I, again? No, no. You want to look no, again? No, 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 no. no? Okay, no. I show you. No, no, no. Oh. Um, One to ten. No. Man wasn't about to get disrespected. It's just pitiful behavior when women only lead when they're with their appearance and their sexuality and expect men to just simp over them. We're ending the simp epidemic. The Knicks Nation over here, we're ending it. This, you have to marry me. Ready, set, go. Oh, bro, I had to chunk that thing. <laughs> you never make it. You never make it. Oh, oh he, he sunk it. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> God looked out. <laughs> that's actually pretty diff. That's pretty impressive for cornhole. I don't know if you guys have ever played. No. <laughs> that was probably the last time. Do you think I'm skinny? Why would you ask somebody that? It's so what should you do if she really wants to break up with you, but you really don't want to let her go? You let her go. What are you going to do? Always. Force her to stay? If yeah. she wants to go, let her. 
It's yeah. not your job to try to convince her to stay. If it gets to that point where she wants to break up, she's already made up her mind. Yeah, it's just really Facts. sad. <laughs> it is. It is. What if the man really loves the woman and he still wants to be with her, so you don't think Doesn't you matter. should beg? I no. would really like to be black from the waist down, and I'm not. <laughs> it's just certain things that aren't happening. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, oh, I really love her. Okay, so she has to stay. Oh, well, are you going to lock her in the basement? Mm. Yeah, exactly. Just like, like, you cannot, like, if she wants to go, immediately. If yeah, she wants immediately to leave, she gets to go. Immediately let her go. You say, cool, no worries. Wish you all the best. Let me pack. <laughs> Do you just replace her? Oh, <laughs> replace? Of course. Sometimes yeah. it's not that easy to replace someone, though. It's easy, or it's simple, it's not. but not easy. Simple, you just meet a lot of people, and then replace that person. It sounds harsh, but you actually can replace everybody. I'm guessing you can help people with that kind of thing. Yeah, of course. Because you can never replace the individual, but that individual was just meeting a need of yours, the need for love and connection. You can find somebody else who meets that need in right. a way that's healthier for the both of you. Because the second she wants to leave, you just say, next. She's made up her mind. Yeah. At that point, in Germany, we would say, the Zug is abgefahren. The train has left the station. Women want... Facts, you never beg. I told you guys this story in college where I was bucking this girl. She's like, she saw I was texting another girl. She's like, I can't do this. I was like, bon voyage. Adios, muchacho. I helped her walk herself out. But you can't ever beg. Begging puts you at a deficit because the thing is, two weeks later, she came back knocking on my door, bro. Most toxic thing an ex has done to you? Um, probably been in the army. What, and that's toxic? Yeah. That's toxic? What? Oh, we, we appreciate all of our military members here. Shout out to all the guys doing the thing. I appreciate you guys, man. And ladies, too. That's because it's like, oh my God, they get to do that and then, like, live, you know? Yeah. Like, they get to do that and then, like, have their life. What? And, like, like I'm, like, like now, like, fighting for, like, a roof over my head. And, like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Now Fighting for a roof? You're doing a podcast. You can't be doing that bad. When I made a video about Tiana and Cody for it, right, and y'all was, it went viral. I made like two videos, and I said her whole personality is being a NFL wife or just dating a man that's in the NFL. Oh. Y'all, y'all tried to get mad at me about it. That was her whole personality. Now she's using a breakup situation to push herself even more. She's still making it her personality because without Cody Ford, who the f she? She's no longer Nobody. the girlfriend, so what now? Now she's continuously making videos about this man, telling the whole story, still profiting. Now she's saying she's fighting for a roof over her head. I doubt that. She's white with a million something followers or millions of followers on TikTok. There's no yeah, way she's broke. Let, let's be for real. But to get on here doing all this, bro, it just shows that my point is proven. Who the fuck is Cody Ford? <laughs> Maybe she. I'll be honest, I'm not too privy. To this entire drama, who's Cody Ford? But he counted for one. You can't make your entire identity being with someone else, but a lot of women do this. Dollar, what could you buy with your body count? PS5. A milkshake. Okay. And what about you? What could you buy? Five drinks. I beg your pardon. Five drinks. What type of drinks are we talking? Two Doubles. shots and two drinks. Bruh, you're moving out here. You're you're doing your thing, huh? She's a runner. She's a track star. Okay. And are y'all out here trying to add one more? No. Yes. <laughs> I love Have it. you ever added more than one body in the same day? I know she has. More than three. Wait, no, wait. More than three? What did you actually add? Five. Bruh. In one day? Yeah. Where is your dad? Where is your mom? Where is your family? Her goal is to <laughs> Where is your dad? Where is your mom? Hey, Siri, show me the relationship with her father. <laughs> I need to see that real quick. Hey, Google. Show me the relationship with her, daddy. Latino man? It doesn't matter. I want to marry a man. I want to marry a man. Okay, what do you mean by that? You're not a man, bro? What's a man for you? Maybe we'll find him here. What's a man? Okay, five things. Money. Money, yes, absolutely. Yes, to be well grounded. Well grounded. Take out the trash. We just Any took you out. Been here? <laughs> for a guard. I need him to take out trash every day. What do you do for a living, sir? Sanitation. Sanitation? Oh. The trash! The trash! <laughs>
<laughs> Grounded, stable, throws the trash. <laughs> Two phones, because one's for the trash. I think she just found her match. Hopefully he doesn't mistake. Bro, that's, that's crazy work. Well grounded and he's have money. Question a lot, but uh, I'm not married. Who cares? You're on Instagram. The lie detective determined that was a lie. Oh! I'm going getting that question a lot. Instagram seeking validation from strangers. A winner. Hey, we got a 22 Ram 2500 that needs attention. Come holla. She got this question. I love this guy. I've seen him before. <laughs> it was like a big bag chick being like, uh... There's something I don't do every day. And he's like, yeah, put the fork down. Look, I got a 2023. <laughs> I like him a lot. I have a Band-Aid because I think I just scraped my knee falling for you. Oh, no, I'm doing too far. Oh. 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 Have a good time. <laughs> women will say he bro. missed out on a... I just think I, that's actually not bad, but women be doing this in the worst possible. You can see this man's trying to do to something. Rate their looks on a scale of one to 10. You can't pick seven starting with you. Go ahead. Rating my scale. own look? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you know why you can't do seven? This is a Kevin Samuels philosophy. You can't do seven because it's like a middle ground and most women rate themselves a seven. When you take out seven, a six is like below that seven. So it's like, ugh, you're only a six, which means you're one step above average. And then an eight means you're an eight, nine, or a 10. A 10 would be Adriana Lima in her prime when she was a runway model. And then I would put like Kelly Rowland and Halle Berry up there as well. Um, as far as eight, nine, and 10. It's pretty beautiful and gorgeous is the scale. 10. 10. I'm going to go for an eight. Okay. Yeah, eight. On like a really good day, eight. I think an eight. I was going to say seven and a half, but eight. Four. <laughs> I give my... The lie detective determined that was a lie. Oh! Eight, nine, or ten. You're telling me you're as hot as Halle Berry, Kelly Rowland, or Adriana Lima in their prime. Stop capping. Self of five. We have two tens at the table. Really? Yeah. Who do you think the prettiest girl in the room is? I would say I think you're very pretty. Thank you. So why do you think she rates herself less than you rate yourself if she's the prettiest? I don't know. I think that'd be a question for her. So who's yeah. the second prettiest girl? <laughs> This is so foul. The reason this question is asked, it's not actually ever asked to be offensive. Mm. It's asked to determine the delusion level. Mm. If I'm comparing mm. myself to the most attractive men on planet Earth, mm. yeah, I'm a f four. Ryan, he's delusional. He ain't a five either. But the thing is, <laughs> at least a five is more. <laughs> yeah. Poor Brian. I give myself a six. Chat, rate me in the comments right now. We, we do this probably every, like, 15 episodes. Let me know what you think. I think I'm a solid six. I'm 6'2", 180. I'm well-groomed. I'm in okay shape. I got a little bit of money, I guess. Let me know what you think. More rational and reasonable than I'm a 10 on par with the most beautiful women in the existence of the world, right? I mean, I think we all have to be a little delusional to get no. through our lives. I blame Sims for why I, force I, I, I don't think anybody has to be delusional to get through your life. I, I don't think that's... No. Ten, how do you like it? You like it? What's ten? Hard. Let's ten. give it like out of a seven. Twelve. Do you like it hard, hard? <laughs> Could you see yourself talking to me? Of course, I love my short kings. Now, what are the chances that me and you could link up? Link up? I don't know about that. I'm a lady, but I will get to know you. That's what. That's the lie detective determined that was a lie. Oh! You're on the streets wearing that. You're not a lady, honey. You're a lady of the night. That's what link up means. Okay. You gonna take me on a date or what? Depends. What would you like to do? Um, take me to coffee or something. Coffee? Yeah. I can do a coffee. Okay. I'm not gonna give it up like that, nah. But Did I say that girl? You being carried. When a girl says that she's gonna give it up, not gonna give it up, she's thinking I'm gonna give it up. That's actually a great sign there. When a girl's talking about like you're not gonna be able to get this, you know how many times in college a girl's like, you're not gonna be able to hit. You're not going to be able to hook up with me. I don't do hookups. I don't do one night stands and then got a one night stand and then got a hookup out of it. Like these girls are projecting so hard. They're thinking about it. That's why they're saying it out loud. Some people assume that. You being is it the wrong dudes. I'm no, a kid. I know, I know, I know, I know. You got kids? Heck no. Are you trying to have a kid? Hell no. Really? Yes, you are. No, I'm not. She, she wants to give me nephews and nieces. Yes, no, she does. I know. Nice are you trying to have a kid? Yes, nice I'm to meet you. To well, can, I get your, can I get your number? Okay. okay yeah. Okay. Are you saying my number, my Instagram? He just everything? scored a double just, right there. Your number. Whatever you want. Are you trying to? Yeah. Are you trying to? Yeah. Sensational. Yeah. He's sister. so That's forward. That's your sister? Yes. Biologically? Yes. Or like my friends? Like. But if you hit my sister up, don't hit me up though. Wait, what? If you hit my sister up, don't hit me up though. I'm here to tell you right now. We don't care. Let me tell you. <laughs> The older That's a good old two for one. I would call those back in the days a good old referral. You buck one girl, 
And then she tells her other friends how great the bucking was, and then the other girls are like, I want to get a little bucking out of that. She's a runner, she's a track star. <laughs> I would love those back in the days referrals. In college, bro, I'm telling you, like, the sorority girls, ooh, they are the best. Because you buck one, she goes and yaps her gums to her little girlfriends, and then before you know it, the girlfriends are hitting you up, and you're like, well, how did you know about my pin game? And she goes, well, so-and-so told me, it's like, I love referrals. She just woke up with 12 missed calls and 15 texts from their ex. Sid from Ice Age. My ex, Steven, please take me back. I miss you. We can work things. <laughs> Steven, I think it might be time to... <laughs> Steven. Poor Steve-o. Men or women? Women. It's about damn time. Finally, I admit it. Because we're smart. You're you smart. guys aren't smart enough to be complicated. You had me in the first half. Mm. Wouldn't the smart thing to not be complicated? If Wouldn't you're it... stupid, you're super simple, no? Isn't simple usually better? No. Hats, wait. You don't like complexity? You don't, you don't like complexity? You if like simplicity. If these are... uh, I like simplicity. Chat, let me know. Do you like stuff that's complex or simple? I like things that are simple, and I like making things complex simple. I don't know. I think men are we're just basic like that. Too complicated, then it's like you're just making your life harder. Why not make things simple? Life's already hard. Do you hate women? No way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stupid. No. What made you think that? Well, you like simplicity more, no? Are you gay? She got it right the first time. I love it. They always go to the homophobia. What is that? Chat, can y'all educate me? What is that? Because if guys came out the woodwork saying, like, are, are you a lesbian? It would be a whole different conversation, bro. That's a good ring. That's not just like no mediocre. You just sound like 5,000. Like, that's a good ring. That is definitely mediocre. 5,000 is mediocre? I know people who get 27,000 spent on their So if it's so mediocre, how many of you motherfuckers have 5,000 dollar rings on your finger right now? Put them up there. Man, if it's so mediocre, then every one of y'all should have a 5,000 dollar ring on your finger. I can go buy a hold on, hold on, hold on. ring for myself. That... But you ain't bought that motherfucker. A ring for yourself? What? Women always want to talk hypothetical about the money that they could have. The money they could have bought. The nigga they should have had. No, nigga. Reality. You gonna tell me that goddamn this five spent my last five grand on this goddamn ring for your ass to prove my love to you? And you gonna say this shit mediocre? You gonna have a mediocre annulment? You gonna have a mediocre divorce? And you gonna have a mediocre trip back to the mediocre pot mix? Cause I'm not marrying your ass. If you are so goddamn concerned with how much I spent on the ring, you gonna have mediocre government cheese at that point. <laughs> <laughs> she should be grateful He's with a so five thousand dollars. <laughs> These guys are hilarious, bro. I've seen a lot of their clips. Can I ask you a question? What's up? Kiss or slap? Kiss or what? Kiss or slap? Yeah. Turn into an NPC. Bro wanted out of that conversation <laughs> he so. Turn into an NPC. I've never seen that one. That's a good one. That is a good one. Dating experience. I was inside of a Methodist church, and basically in the middle of Shit. the temple is where I had. Does she identify as the bear? Shots fired. What is that? So you have in in church and you claim that you are a holy woman? I Ooh. actually learned how to have peace in Christ. From that experience in church. He gave you a peace next to Christ. Basically, do you know what a reformed Puritan is? Do you know what, what it's like? Are you a reformed Puritan? That's exactly what I am. Okay. So I'm not going to sit here in the middle of this stupid YouTube live platform okay. and expose who I'm having intimacy with. You oh, I already swear. did. Please, you just said you let please. someone clap cheeks in the church. When did you become a reformed whore? <laughs> After or before you got your cheeks clapped in church? She's a runner, she's a track star. Look like you still got them desires to be horn around. Uh, <laughs> he ate her up, bro. He cooked her. Oh, my God. She's, like, destroying the set. I hate when... Uh, it's so awful. So much work goes into this, and all this equipment's Hear so expensive. say, well, I'm just a girl. I know that you're broke and lazy. <laughs> <laughs> I need everybody to pay attention and listen. This is going to open your eyes to a lot. Me and my friends, we were talking to our friends that are women, and we asked them this question. If your man that you're married to was able to buy a $400,000 house with his own income. That's crazy. But if he needed you to help out with the mortgage, you guys can qualify for an $850,000 house. Would you do it? They all said, no, I'm just wow. a girl. <laughs> Broken lazy, bruv. Broken lazy. That's what that means. Broken lazy. They said, no. Like, come on, bruv. Or that's awful. You ain't gonna help your man, Loki. Does somebody want a jerky? You want some jerky, bud? Free. 
Sit. Wait. Free. Free. Go to your place. It's a game. I'm yeah, sick right, of you. Right. I'm sick of you, bro. Right, you can bro. leave. Bro. <laughs> Don't hear me, bro. That's you, bro. That's you, bro. That's you, bro. That's you, bro. You want to hear me? All right, then I'm going to call my mama. I'm going to call my daddy, too. Man. This would be the end of he it. Didn't, he didn't even hit her, though. What are you talking about? He didn't even hit her. This is absolutely, absolutely wild to me, bro. Absolutely wild. The state of the dating market is in shambles. These women expect the world like you're Aladdin on Jasmine with the magic carpet. A whole new world. Looking ass. But they got nothing in return. We don't get your, we don't get your virginity. We sometimes, most of the time, we don't even get your youth, your fertility. Like, it's absolutely crazy to me. There was a clip on Twitter that I saw that I wanted to show you guys. It's a chick that was like, we've reacted to it in the past, and she was talking about all these, like, super high standards that she had. Here, we'll just get, we'll just jump straight into it really quick. A coffee or a walk is a possible date option, and neither should you. First of all, I'm not a dog that needs to be walked. Second, I have an espresso machine at home. Works fabulous. We're not doing drinks either. You're gonna try to get me drunk and take me back home. No, we are doing dinner. You're gonna pick me up. We're gonna come to the restaurant. We're gonna see your table manners. We're just gonna, you know, study you a bit. So she's, she's I started the egg freezing process. I did some preliminary tests, which showed that my egg count is really low. The doctors did tell me that that might affect my fertility my eggs are high quality but they are there's just not a lot of them it's just it's just so sad <sighs> all those high loki stop licking your undergrundle please goodness gracious all those high standards just to end up like that mm, 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 mm. that's why i say ladies you better start you better start looking in your 20s because once you get in your 30s and you hit the wall it's a wrap it's a wrap for you. Once those eggs freeze up, you better start freezing them eggs. And even then, when you freeze your eggs, it's not even 100%. It might not even happen for you. But Loki, did you have a good time today? He's sleepy today. We had to go to the vet earlier today. Um, look at him. I mean, he's doing fine. We went to the vet um, to get a... I don't know why I'm sharing this with you guys. To get a fecal sample. Because we're going to try to take him to a new doggy daycare. And they require a fecal sample, so... I don't know why I told you guys. I tell you guys too much. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go cop the ebook, The Four Pillars of Personality Makes You Irresistible to Women and Respected by Men. I will see you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.